In this video, I'll be teaching you guys exactly how to pass your prop firm challenge using this ICT strategy. Now, I had to sit through in a four and a half long hour ICT video just to get a grasp of these concepts, which I'll be breaking down for you guys in the most simplest terms in literally 10 minutes. So if you cannot sit through this 10 minute video, then this career is not for you. Go back to simple nine to five lifestyle. Okay, this is going to be a very, very simple strategy. And I can guarantee you, as soon as you apply this to your chain, you will become profitable. You guys can go back, test these concepts straight away. You can go forward, test these concepts straight away. And I can guarantee you something in your mind will click where it makes all sense. So without further ado, let's jump straight into the video. Now, I want you guys to understand this is going to be um, a very straightforward strategy. I'll create a checklist for you and I'll be giving you guys a live example uh, bit by bit throughout this whole video. Now, if you guys don't believe that I'm profitable um, in our free telegram below, it's going to be um, in the description below. I share tons and tons of my payouts so much free value the trades that we're going to be taking as you can see here um i had a seven thousand five hundred uh, seven thousand six hundred dollar payout from funding pips and then i also had another uh seven thousand seven thousand five hundred and sixty three payout um, from ftmo itself i share tons of free content as you guys can see our clients are absolutely kidding it. and whoever comes from youtube i guarantee you we will pass a hft prop firm challenge for you for completely free of charge in celebration um of my most recent payouts and the growth that we've actually had recently so if you guys do um want that offer please do message our telegram at which is at zedman admin whoever comes through youtube will be getting a free hft pass you just simply have to let us know that you've come from youtube so do join the telegram in the link below so much free value in there now jumping straight back into the video so first things first we need to understand what pairs we can actually use this strategy on okay guys so i'm gonna have a checklist right next to me uh right here so we can use this on euro usd we can use this on gbp usd and we can use this on gold now this doesn't mean that you can use it on it you can't use it on any other pair i simply just haven't tested it so i simply can't obviously vouch that i can work on those pairs these are my most favorite pairs these are the pairs that i actually trade okay next thing's we need to understand right is um what timing can we actually trade this strategy with so first thing is going to be the london open kill zone now what time is that that's 2 a.m to 5 a.m and then the new york open kill zone that's going to be from 7 a.m to 10 a.m now this timing is in new york timing as ict actually refers everything in new york timing so it makes it easier for me to teach you guys in that if you want to change your trading view to new york timing just go down to the time zone toggle in the bottom right corner go to utc minus four new york um and um yeah it'll change the time to new york time so it is in new york time and we'll just convert it back into your um uh, local timing i do have these indicators that actually mark out my new york and london open kill zone as you can see the green one is a london open kill zone from 2 a.m to 5 a.m and then we have the new york kill zone from 7 a.m till 10 a.m now you guys if you guys want to use this indicator it is called kz boxes um i stick uh no not that one sorry uh, ICT KZ boxes by David. If you guys want to use the exact same settings that I've actually got currently running, these are my colors. Yeah, so that will be the time zones that we can actually use this um, strategy on. Now, what does the strategy actually consist of? So first, we need a liquidity sweep. Then we need a market shift, and then we need an order block slash fair value gap. Okay, guys. What else I'm going to add in there actually is ICTs. OTE levels okay Fibonacci levels now I'll teach you guys what they are in just a second so those are um this is what we're going to need in order to be trading this um strategy uh, yeah so I'm going to be sure basically walking through this whole strategy uh, in this video with a live example of a trade that I personally took as well okay guys so first things first we're on euro usd right oh sorry I'm also going to add we're going to use the 15 minute and five minute okay guys so 15 minute time frame what i'm going to do is simply um mark out liquidity errors prior to my london session open so what time is this this is 1 45 so 15 minutes before london open kill zone is about to start i'm going to mark out this significant low here as a liquidity area and then i'm going to mark out this significant high as a liquidity area as well so our buy side and sell side liquidity has now been marked out like so so 
Once you've marked out your liquidity areas, you need a liquidity sweep. Okay, guys. So first things first, we need to let our session start. Okay. So as you can see, that 2 a.m. candle swept sell side liquidity. Okay, guys. Now, again, we do have a whole video on liquidity, a bit more in-depth understanding of liquidity. But for now, um, significant highs and lows can be used for liquidity. Okay, guys, that's not an issue at all. Now, as soon as you get this liquidity sweep, you need to drop into the five minute time frame. Okay, so liquidity sweep done. We've also got the London open kill zone, which we're trading. Uh, we're trading Euro USD. And now we are seeking a market structure shift, guys. Okay, so first things first, we're going to mark out our high. So where's our most local structure? So we've got this high here, which we want to seek a market structure shift to. Okay, so I'm going to change this color to white just so it's not seen as liquidity. Okay, now we need a market structure shift through this high unless we do create a new high. Okay, bang. We've had our market structure shift, guys. Okay. As soon as you get your market structure shift, this is where you are hunting. Now, you are hunting for an entry, okay, guys? What type of entry are you hunting for? Now, this is where OTE and the order block and fair value get coming. What is OTE? OTE is simply a Fibonacci tool. As you guys can see, it's a Fibonacci retracement. These are my Fibonacci levels. These are also ICT Fibonacci levels. Um, if you guys want to use the same settings, just do use that. Now, the OTE levels are the 61.8, the 71, and the 78.6. These three are OTE levels. Now, I'll be explaining briefly what OTE means. Now, how to draw your Fibonacci is from the low to the high, okay, of that market structure swing point. So, that high and the low that's been created within that market structure swing. So, OTE levels, again, is the 71, uh, the 61.8 and the 78.6 level, okay? Now, what this does, this gives you a very, very precise entry, as you know, ICT is so precise, so, so, so precise, and it gives you such a better risk to reward ratio, okay? So that is exactly what this is. This will just allow us to give um, a precise entry. So we want to only take entry within our OTE levels, okay? Note that down, guys. Now, within the OTE levels, to make it such a much, uh, much more stronger confluence, you need an oil block or a fair value gap. Doesn't matter which one. Totally uh, down to you which one you choose. I just personally like using order blocks. I think they're a bit more cleaner, um, but it's totally down to you guys, okay? So, um, yeah. So, we've had our market structure shift. We just want to make sure, is this our swing high? Okay, that wasn't even our swing high. So, we're going to move our Fibonacci to that high. Now, how do we know if it's an actual high? Okay, that wasn't even our high, okay? So, okay. Now, this was our high. How do we know it's our high? Because the candle prior and after was below that swing point. So, we're going to move our Fibonacci tool from that high. So, low to the high. Okay, guys. Now, now that we have had our low, is that our low? Okay, yeah. So, we've had our, um, our sorry, our high created, right? Um, we need to mark out where our order block and fair value gap is within OTE. So I'm going to get my box tool. As you guys can see within OTE, we have this down close candle just prior to this impulsive move up. Uh, this sort of doji is where my order block is going to be. And as you can see, it works perfectly because what is it is within our OTE levels. So this is really going to give us a precise reading and a precise entry on price. So once that's done, we're simply now, this is where patience comes in. We simply wait for a retracement into our area. Bang. As soon as we get the retracement in, you can either have a buy limit set or simply be watching the markets actively. I like watching it actively. Um, you are going to be taking entry. Now, entry is being taken, right? You need to, where are you going to place your stop loss? Oh. Um, let's move this here. So stop loss is going to be at either the low or just under the order block. If you're doing it under the order block, just make sure that um, it is going to be a little bit more riskier. Uh, whereas if you have it at the low and you know that low is going to stay intact, then it's just a bit more safe. Okay, guys, so that's two. So if you want to go aggressive, have it under the order block. If you want to be slightly conservative, have it at the low. Now, TP is going to be um, the next uh, liquidity, the opposed to liquidity, which is going to be this high here, um, which I've got marked out um, for a one to almost one to three risk draw ratio, so 2.5. Entry has been taken and the rest is history. I could have even gone for this sort of opposing liquidity, which would have been what I wanted for. But that is how easy this strategy is, guys. So hopefully this video really did help you guys. Very straightforward, very clean. And I promise you, you can backtest this. It works amazing. I teach us way more in depth in our mentorship, of course. But this alone can get you profitable and I can guarantee that. Um, 
Remember, join the Telegram in the link below. We are doing a free HFT pass to anyone who comes through YouTube. This is our Telegram at ZMN Admin. Uh, we share tons and tons of value. As you can see, clients absolutely killed it today with gold. Um, even yesterday, we killed it with gold. Uh, caught a one to three withdrawal ratio. I give trade ideas, signals, share so all my payout, so much value. But yeah, hopefully that does help you guys out. If you enjoy this video, drop a like. If you've got any questions, drop a comment and I'll get back to everyone as well.